we're going to react to the tribute to Chadwick Boseman. Oh boy. I'm uh, yes. Chadwick Boseman tribute. Alright, so <clears throat> Wakanda forever. Boseman's performance in 42 that really made us take a second look. There is, there is such an honor and dignity to the way that he played Jackie Robinson that we knew we needed for the character of T'Challa, the Prince of Wakanda. Chadwick is an amazing actor who we thought would fit perfectly with the MCU. Black Panther himself, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Chadwick Boseman. He has a lot of uh, depth. It was amazing as an audience member to, to, you know, to look into his eyes and see what's going on. We must find a way to look after one another as if we were one single tribe. A lot of the things about the character are also true about Chad. He's very knowledgeable. He's an athlete, you know, a martial artist. He's had a lot of experience playing roles that come with a lot of weight, you know. So I think he has a he has a person, he has a guy, has a lot of has, has a lot of weight to him. I think he brings all that that stuff to the role. But not to mention that he's incredibly, you know, incredibly gifted as an actor, as a performer, and also as a storyteller in his own right. I am not king of all people. I am king of Wakanda, and it is my responsibility to make sure our people are safe. Because he is so prepared as an actor. And because his character is sort of flawless on set, it forced the other actors who had scenes with him to kind of raise their game and go, okay, this guy's not taking anything for granted. He's really leaving it all out there. So we have to keep up with him. What doesn't Chadwick bring to the character? I mean, he's regal and grounded and he brings a gravitas to it. So all of this feeds his T'Challa and uh, I think he wore the crown with dignity. He brought back! He brought back! I've known him since I was about like 17, so I've known him for a really long time um, back in New York. He did the work, obviously. You know, I just think he did an incredible job being true to the, to the character. I had a great time with Chadwick, just warmth and camaraderie came into it, of course, with a great deal of respect for his previous work. So when I looked at him with proud eyes, you know, they were as mother and, and also as, as comrade and colleague and Angela. It is your time to be king. Give me crush. I mean, Chadwick is just a powerhouse. He really is so talented. Every single movie he's made, there's this kind of this internal, almost nobility. The Black Panther has been the protector of Wakanda for generations. He's such a soulful actor and um, so professional, so present. He really gives so much to the other person. And, and he's awesome and his presence on set, I think, makes it kind of raises the stakes a little bit for everybody. Chadwick is a, he's a really smart, interesting, dynamic guy. And I think I think he was not overwhelmed, but very surprised and somewhat taken aback by the amount of love. It ceased to become just about how well he inhabited the role and all that stuff. It's become part of our culture just as a symbol. This vocal is, is one of the most amazing things I've ever experienced. It's fun to watch just what it means to people. At times, like I, in my head, I'll be like, well, what does this do for the world like actually what is it you know is it actually valuable in, in this climate and i have to say yes it actually is not because it, it makes people escape i think when done right um it gives people hope i found that it means a lot
No, I already started choking up. I already, um... The fact that he was sick through all that, mm -hmm. like, it seemed like up until earlier this year, it looked like that's where it got really worse, because um, a lot of interviews he did, a lot of movies he did, or whatever movies he did um, last year, he looked fine and healthy, even though he was sick. But once, a few months ago came, and that video went viral that um, when he would look really thin and people were concerned, it was messed up, but people were making fun of him too. And they were talking about that online. How people were like kind of cracking jokes on him, making fun of him, not even know knowing that he was sick. Mm -hmm. So I wonder how does all those people right now feel about making fun of him? Mm -hmm. Not even knowing this man, you know, had cancer. You know, it's it's just really sad because he had, I'm sure, a lot more work to do, and many people to um, work with too. So I was see some. Oh God, that was nice though the way they put that together for him. Oh, so sad.